I appreciate you all putting on your nicest shorts to be here tonight. <laughs> Thank you very much. If you guys know that you have two breweries right next to each other, what's the deal? Were they pouring too fast over there? <laughs> Damn, the beer's good, but they pour it too fast. I wish we had a brewery right next door. <laughs> How drunk can you get? You guys, DTPF? Down to play Fortnite? Just me? I like this place, there's only one TV and it is comedy show related. I hate doing comedy at bars because I don't really drink. I don't know if I fit in at bars with the people there. I just feel like personally I can't trust anyone who owns over 10 TVs, but no Nintendo 64. That's a bad ratio to have. But like we're not going to hang out. They always have the same sports game playing on every TV. I'm like, we can't get Super Smash Bros. going on one of these things. <laughs> Mario Kart, at least. Everyone likes that. Uh, one time my mom called me up, real excited, and she was like, Billy, guess what? I just got a brand new 60-inch color TV. And I was like, Mom, all TVs are color now. <laughs> You didn't really have to specify. <laughs> like what if my roommate came home one day and he was like, check it out, dude. It's 100 inches. It's 3D, 4K. I'd be like, is it color? <laughs> it was a good deal. <laughs> we could love watch I Love Lucy or Andy Griffith's show in HD. That would be cool. <laughs> MASH, maybe. Uh, how are the New Year's resolutions going? Are you guys getting jacked and tan or what? <laughs> that was my resolution. It's not working out. Uh, I wanted to get in shape though. I wanted to just get healthy, right? I went to the store. I bought some vitamins when I got home. I realized the vitamins that I bought were for men age 55 plus. <laughs> but I'm kind of broke, so I've just been taking them. I figure when I'm 55, my prostate will be immaculate. <laughs> I haven't checked on it in a while. But the night is young. This is technically Atlanta, right? <laughs> you guys seem open-minded. <laughs> They've been messing me up, dude. Every time I pop one of those Equate 55 pluses, I just want to put on tube socks and watch golf. <laughs> They're messing me up, man. I play scratch off even when there's a line. I bought a house on Lake Lanier. It's weird, man. It made me feel weird. So I'm like, I need to get, uh, I need to get on a workout routine, right? I need to stick to a program. The only workout routine I could think of off the top of my head was the presidential fitness test. Remember that from school? Yeah, presidential. George Bush was the president. You guys voted for him, remember? All right. <laughs> she voted for him. <laughs> We're in Lawrenceville, guys. <laughs> uh, I wanted to uh, do the presidential fitness test because I just wanted to make sure that I'm still in good enough shape that I can still kick a fifth grader's ass. <laughs> and it turns out, no, I cannot. A fifth grader would mess me up, dude. He'd be Fortnite dancing over my body, like, what's up, bitch? <laughs> I've never been yeeted before. I don't know what it means. I've been beat up before, but never to the soundtrack, Old Town Road, <laughs> by Lil Nas X, featuring Billy Ray Cyrus. I miss being a kid. I miss riding bikes around the neighborhood. I feel like I never see kids riding bikes anymore. It's just grown men wearing spandex. <laughs> right? Ugh. I'm sorry to all the cyclists who are obviously in the room. Uh, 
But how come the guy wearing the spandex always also has a beer gut? What is that about? <laughs> like, if you're going for aerodynamics, I don't think body hair was your problem. <laughs> I think the problem is you have two breweries <laughs> right next to each other. Yeah, you guys are gonna make me cry during this thing. <laughs> I'm just saying, they put the alcohol by volume, but they don't put the calories. <laughs> I feel like on the opposite hand, with the way I look and like my demeanor, I should probably put on the spandex. <laughs> or I look like a meth head breaking into people's houses. <laughs> right? Like I should go monster energy sponsorship. <laughs> or at least put on some shorts. Another thing I miss about my childhood was those Girls Gone Wild commercials that used to come on at 4 a.m. Yeah, because I don't even have cable anymore. I feel like paying for TV shows with advertisements in between, that's a rich man's game. I got Netflix and Hulu, I don't pay for either one. It's not happening. We need a Girls Gone Wild reboot, call Disney or whoever it is. I want to know where those girls are in their lives. I want to know if they're still going wild. I want to know if they're still girls. Well, they gotta at least be women by now, right? And that's being generous. Uh, you seem too excited. It'll be called Women and Non-Binary Persons Gone Wild. Call Netflix. Netflix would take that trash and you know it. They took cuties. Those girls weren't even 18. Alright, don't get mad at me. I don't work there. I didn't green like that. Cuties was a movie about young girls twerking. Alright. I feel like you guys haven't seen it. Uh, hey John, thank you so much for having me, man. Thank you guys so much for